um, the challenge was a little bit like, like you know, if I could do something that that create a story uh, around the same character, Annie, and make like an incredible trip for an audience to watch over two hours. That would be at least as exciting, if not more exciting, than the first one. And actually, also would it be make it appealing for a larger audience because I wanted to make sure that kids could see this movie as well. Because it, I, I like to make movies that are that don't show any direct violence. I mean, just as you could have seen in the movie, there's no blood, whatever. It is like it is pure thrill. It's just pure like you like seeing sitting on the front row of a, of a speeding car, a speeding bullet, and that is uh, to create. Uh, uh, suspense and, and, and excitement with pure visual means. That, that is, was for me the biggest challenge. What's the secret then? How do you create suspense like that? Uh, I, I don't know if, the, how this, uh, how, if there's a secret or not. And it to me kind of comes a little bit natural. I, I always feel like when I make scenes like that, I always want to be right where the camera shouldn't be. <laughs> you know, I always put them right there. And, you know, and, and, something runs into it it's like it's, it's I think it's want to be in the front row a little bit it's like being like a uh, absolutely like as, as, as extra playing a scene I want to be right next to them you know I want to be like never white so now I want to be right in their faces and it's, 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 I don't know it comes also I, I, emotion is like very important to me I'm uh, the camera always moves in my movies and, and it's it's, it is something that I guess I've been doing for most of my life as a cinematographer too. And motion also brings you into a movie as well. It kind of forces you to really focus, you focus your, your vision a little bit. Now these days, filmmakers think in terms of financial success, of course, as well as all the other things. Did you ever think that there was going to be a speed two and conceivably a speed three? Will it, will no. it never end? No. <laughs> well, I don't, um, no, you never think about that. I mean, it's like a, it's, it is... It, basically, the studios always come up with those ideas. It's like I don't think a filmmaker says, uh, set, "It's a set out to make a movie." Think, oh, if I do this, I can make a sequel and another sequel. It is the, because it is successful and, and the characters are very appealing. Is that's when the ideas start to occur to most in studios' heads. Well, let's try another one. And and in most cases, it's very hard to do because you're you know you don't want to repeat yourself. How can you be different? And and still have something exciting and still similar, you know, because you, it, the audience want to be the same thing and they want to be different at the same time. So it's really hard to, to, to mix those two. And what about working with two great stars like Jason and Sandra? I think, I, I think it was a really pleasant experience. I mean, Sandy is like, you know, ideal to work with uh, as a director. She's, she totally gives herself over to the movie. She has, you know, she's absolutely dedicated. She's just no, you know, if she has to stand in the rain for a week, she will do that. And she's, she won't complain. And she, she really also has to make it as, best, as good as possible. And Jason too, you know, this is his first big action movie and and he really threw himself into it, you know, and, and, and he enjoyed it. That's the key thing to, I think, a successful movie that you can see that the actors had a good time while they were making it because... It was a very physically demanding movie, wasn't very it? Very physically demanding, yeah. And also physically demand because he basically had to do most of his own stunts because it's the camera is always so close that you cannot use the stunt double, you know. Now th that to me is also part of the extra gratification when you s watch a movie like this, you know it's them. It's not fake. It's now just doubles here. It's like the real act, and, and, and that, that you can see it in their in their in their reaction. You can see it in their faces. You can see the excitement and the the whole bodily reaction is different when when it's them, you know. Which is, that to me is exciting as well. 